We're stuck. Can we not get out of here? <laughs> Come on, you can do it. Yes, you got out of the water. Okay. Hello, YouTube. My name is Inflick, and welcome back to Hello Neighbor. I know I finished the game already, and I shouldn't be doing videos on it this soon. But in the last build, we did some file editing, and I was able to change the gravity, and I was able to do different things, and then I used Cheat Engine to teleport, and I didn't show you guys how to do it. But now, Tiny Build, the developer, has allowed us to cheat officially in Hello Neighbor. So I'm gonna be showing you how to do that. The first thing you have to do is you have to press the tilde, I think it's called tilde, tilde, something. It's that squiggly line right next to your one button on the keyboard. If you press that, there'll be a command line at the bottom. Type in England, no. <laughs> Type in enable cheats, okay? So now cheats are enabled. I'm not sure if you have to do that first, but we're gonna get to the good stuff. So if you press fly, you can start flying around, okay? You can fly everywhere if you want to. It's kind of slow, though. It's not as good as my gravity stuff. Well, it's almost like the gravity stuff. But you can't go through the wall. You want to go through the wall, don't you? You want to go to access... You want to access places that you haven't been before. Okay, to do that, you have to press ghost. Well, type ghost, not press it. And if you press ghost, you get to go under the world, over the world, everywhere, okay? Including a specific place, right there, under his house. You know what I'm talking about. I'm gonna be doing that in the second video. This video, we're just exploring the basic stuff before we can do that. If you say walk, it puts you down in the world and you can walk around just like normal mode. There's nothing special. There's a couple commands that don't work. God mode didn't work for me. I don't think it works, but those are the main ones. Anyway, do you really need more cheats? I think that's enough, right? So let's start exploring. I'm gonna put ghost mode on. Ghost mode, and we can fly around, and we can access this room. This room was locked, even though there's no lock. Let's go inside. Okay, it's just random room. I guess it's like the other house. There's nothing really in it. You can actually go around. We can actually search for stuff, okay? But first, I want to go under his house, not to the basement. Basement is in the next video, and it is awesome. I checked it out just really fast. Okay, so you have another neighbor. I'm assuming this is the cutsy neighbor. You know, the creepy cutsy neighbor, and he has a key, and that's me. I didn't even notice that. Hey, man, you're looking kind of uh, unhappy. You need to sleep some more. Your eyes are not looking good. I never even noticed that. Okay, so you have a key, a neighbor, the main character, and then... What is this? Cupboard, basement door. I think these are the cutscene things. I'm not sure if there's another house like the Alpha 2 build. I mean the Alpha 1 build, but look at him. We're right under him. Should I just fly in front of him? Will he catch me? <laughs> I just went through him. He must be pissed, right? Hey man, I'm in the walls. I'm watching you. How does it feel? Wait, don't want to go there. Get me out of this area. You're not supposed to see this. And right now we are under the house, under the world. There's another box over there. I don't know what that is. I haven't seen this. Under this is the basement. This is how to get to the basement. Another way, with cheats, of course. So we're gonna go exploring. Let's check out the world. There's a graveyard. Why is there a graveyard here? Are we gonna find some secrets? Possibly. Do they have names on them? Please have names. So we can decipher some ancient texts. It doesn't look like there's any names. I don't know why there's a graveyard here. There's the same houses in the other build right there. I want to find a cloned house. I'm not sure if there is one. Maybe there is because I'm not sure really. We can go through these houses. There's nothing in these houses though. I'm loving these graphics though. A lot better than the last one. Okay, there's... Is that a lake? There's a freaking lake. It looks awesome. Can we go swimming? There's a house there. Okay, let's... Let's go walk. Let's walk around the world now since we're outside. We can go in the water and... It doesn't, it doesn't act like water. Oh no, we're under the water now. Okay, let's get out of the water. We're stuck. Can we not get out of here? <laughs> Come on, you can do it. Yes, you got out of the water. Okay, running out of the water. I never thought I would say running out of the water, but this is what's happening now. Is that another house or is that the same house? I think, no, that's my house. Okay, skipping that outside the map. All right, I need to see what that thing is. I can't even get to it. We're gonna have to fly to it. Love flying to the shed. It looks like just the shed shed that I had in the first video. Yeah, nothing here. Go through the world, into the water. The water was really nice though. Okay, let's go out. Let's fly into the air and then we will find something else. That's another house. That is, that's, that's another one. There's another house over there and another house over there. Are these clones of those? Possibly. It does look like the house, doesn't it? Or at least one of them. 
Let's check what's in here. Absolutely nothing. I don't think it is. This is a clone of my house. So that means, nope, there's nothing there. Okay, I think the other thing is probably a clone of the other house. Yeah, see, here's another clone of the house. That's so weird. Why are there clones of houses? And it's like, it's halfway underground. And there's nothing under, of course, right? Yep, nothing under it. I guess they just use the same model. Actually, it's not the same house. It's just a different one. Is that the old house? Maybe? Maybe it's the pre-alpha house? I'm not sure. Is that the burning building? This is another one. Same thing. Weird house. It has trees in it. <laughs> and there's sounds. And why is there sounds there? Is that the basement? Maybe it was the pre-alpha basement. I'm not sure. I'm looking for the burning house right now. Burning house was at the edge of the map. That could be it. It does look like it, right? I think, I think it's the same house. Possibly. It's not burning right now. No more burning houses. Yeah, it does look like the right house. Th there was burning fire there and fire over there. There's houses in the distance. Why? <laughs> Why are there flying houses? This map is weird. Okay, I'm gonna try going under now, okay? There are... There's that. I guess that's the basement and this is something else. Let's go check what this is. Or is this what we're in already? I think this... That's where we are. I'm gonna check what that box is. Actually, I'm gonna check what this box is. Yes. That is a border to the basement. Okay, we're going to the other box on top. Because I don't know what that is. <laughs> Unless that's another basement. There's two basements. That looks like water. Why is there water here? It's water. <laughs> it was a water box. I thought it was a basement. So the basement is under there. And we're going to do it in the second video of today. So I'm having two videos today. I wish there was a third person mode. That would be cool, right? We get into the car. Is the, why, is the, why is the car under the world? Oh, it's because it's part of the cutscene. There's no more cars in front of us. What is he gonna- Can he catch me while I'm in there? I don't think he can. Hey, dude. Can you? I don't think so. Can you catch me while I'm- While I'm- the, Oh, the sounds. Look at my shadow as I fly through the world. So there's a lot of empty places upstairs that you're not supposed to get to. Like this room. Nothing here, though. Or this one. Nothing there. And then in here is that room that we were at with the golden apple. Oh, no. He's gonna appear, isn't he? Is there, is there a golden apple in this one? I don't think so. Okay. Unless we can lock the door somehow. It doesn't look like there's any locking for this one. But they said they were trying to block the neighbor in. I remember one video Tiny Build posted where you put boxes in front of the door and he can't pass it. I would probably try that another one. Blocking the neighbor in. We still haven't figured out how to glitch him. It looks like he's unglitchable at the moment. I'm sure a lot of people have got him stuck. But not an easy method like the last one. I really love this build. Amazing. See how far he goes. There's a car that goes through here and the car isn't moving. Why is this car not moving? It is moving. It's on. Someone left. <laughs> it's my car. So we are in the car and we're driving right now. <laughs> this is the biggest clickbait if I put that, right? Not doing that. Don't worry. I'm just trying to see if there's something else. I don't think there is. There's a mannequin there too. I guess that's part of the cutscene too. Thing. I don't know what that is really. But yeah. I guess that's about it. Not much else to see in this build. I'm going to be doing a lot of Hello Neighbor videos. Most probably this time it's going to be challenges though. Challenges. Not these glitches and stuff like that. I might try to glitch the neighbor out. Try to screw him up in different places. I'm not sure yet. But there's going to be a lot more. It's a smaller shorter build. I understand that. But it doesn't matter. It's fun testing builds out. Trying to find the bugs. It helps the developers at the end of the day doesn't it? And helps us YouTubers, of course. <laughs> okay, anyways, I guess I'm gonna have to end this video here. There's gonna be another video that's gonna include the whole basement. Yes, the whole basement is included in this. Of course, you have to use cheats to get there. Because otherwise, once you end it, cutscene, it kills everything. <laughs> it stops the game if you get through the cutscene. But we're gonna be going into the basement. I'm probably gonna post it in two hours from uploading this video. So you guys are gonna see that. Anyways... Remember, in the beginning of this video, I showed you how to use the cheats. So you can use the cheats now. You can be happy and cheat in Hello Neighbor. Of course, this only works in this build. The other builds don't have this console tilde key thing, swirly. It looks like that. It looks like a small dash, like a curved up and down dash. Anyways, I'm going to have to end this video here. I hope you guys liked it. If you enjoyed this video, give this video a like. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Netflix!